Given that it's fairly obvious to all, including this reporter, that uh, Congressman Perriello will have more money no matter what, uh, what is your plan to overcome that? Well, you know, we, I was very proud that we raised uh, $100,000, more than $100,000 in this first quarter. And, uh, and and while that was not as much as Mr. Perriello has raised, obviously he is um, uh, is a, is is the candidate uh, for the Democrats, and he is going to all of the uh, all of the the, the, the likely places uh, for his support. Uh, I'm proud of the work that we've done to to, to get folks all across the fifth district to support us, especially at a time when there are you know many people vying for this nomination. I think once we get through this primary, we will be well positioned to be able to, to go head to head with Tom Perriello in fundraising not just here uh, in the 5th District, but I, I, I know uh, that there will be widespread interest really across this country uh, in seeing um, Tom Perriello uh, defeated. Uh, I think that that's based on the fact that he is, has been mentioned uh, more, on more, more on more than one occasion as being really one of uh, the president's favorites, uh, certainly a favorite of Nancy Pelosi. And I think that if we're going to get the change that is needed in this country. Uh, I think everybody recognizes we've got to get rid of the current speaker, and the only way to do that is to, to start with uh, right here in the 5th District.